Hello guys and welcome to BT Watch. If you're buying a new watch, be it your first or your 15th, it'd be good to know what the best new watches on offer are, right? Because the sheer volume of choice is insane. With that in mind, we've done the hard work for you, compiling the hottest watch releases as they happen in one wristy place. Go get amongst, these are the best new watches we recommend adding to your collection, or at least stick on the wish list. In 2022, Zodiac released the first ceramic version of its Super Seawolf watch. That watch features a black ceramic case, and now, in 2023, Zodiac has come back with a white ceramic case, in a few versions with bright summer colors. I must clarify what a ceramic case means in this instance because Zodiac does it a bit differently than most. Essentially, the ceramic part of the case is like a cap that sits on top of a steel intersection. If you look under the watch, you can see how the case is constructed, but from the top of the case, it appears to just be white ceramic. Why this particular manner of assembling a ceramic case? There are a number of reasons mostly related to cost and performance. A good example is how challenging it would have been to offer a full 200 meters of water resistance with a full ceramic case. For the money and style, I think Zodiac did an excellent job of offering performance and looks. More so, the resulting case is marginally wider than the stock 40mm wide Super Seawolf watches in steel cases. Thus, the case size for these SSW ceramic models goes up to about 41mm wide and 13.2mm thick. Water resistance, again, is 200m and the case uses 20mm wide straps. Zodiac wanted to be playful and combine a white ceramic case with some of the fun colorways that have been popular for other versions of the Super Seawolf. The three resulting references are the Zodiac Super Seawolf Z09590 with the blue dial, the Z09591 with silver and orange dial, and the Z09592 with the mostly green dial. Zodiac has experienced a lot of success pairing this vintage-style sports watch look with trendy bright colors, so it makes total sense for its design team to be pushing this concept further and further to explore an ever greater variety of aesthetic options that all focus on the same chorus watch personality. The Grand Seiko Spring Drive Hanakata is a remarkable and limited edition timepiece from Grand Seiko, a renowned Japanese watchmaker known for its precision, attention to detail, and unique design philosophy that often draws inspiration from the natural beauty of Japan. The Hanakata, which translates to flower boat, is celebrated for its exquisite craftsmanship, artistic design, and innovative spring drive movement. Inside the SBGY26 is a manual wind spring drive caliber 9R31, perhaps most notable for its dual spring barrel, meaning it has two main springs allowing for a 72-hour power reserve. There's a sly little power reserve indicator on the back of the movement, the absolute best place for a power reserve indicator. It's accurate to 15 seconds per month and the spring drive movement means the second's hand sweeps smoothly across the soft pink dial. The rose gold case measures 38.5 mm by 10.2 mm. It's polished, wears slim on the wrist, and it's got applied and matching indices. Grand Seiko released a handful of impressive sport watches this week too, more on those coming soon, but to me, a watch like the SBGY26 is Grand Seiko in its purest form. A slim, dressy watch with a beautiful textured dial, spring drive caliber, and not much more it comes on a brown croc strap with a three-fold clasp that is gold. In conclusion, the Grand Seiko Spring Drive Hanakata is a testament to the brand's commitment to artistry, innovation, and precision. Fans of the brand are likely to recognize the Tag Heuer Kara Chronograph 60th Anniversaries 39mm wide stainless steel case. This is the same vintage-inspired case layout the brand has used for all its retro-style Kara releases in recent years and closely follows the original Kara design template with its signature inwardly beveled lugs, sleek case profile, and elegantly narrow polished bezel. This fully polished case may be decidedly larger than the original 36mm wide Kara design, but it solidly updates the original Kara ethos for the modern era while retaining the classic who are signature on its three o'clock crown. The largest concession to modernity here comes with the Sapphire display case back, featuring an engraved limited edition serial number and a broad aperture for viewing the decorated in-house movement. As with the rest of the vintage-inspired Kara family, 
The Carrera Chronograph 60th Anniversary provides a respectable 100 meters of water resistance. Tag Heuer powers the Carrera Chronograph 60th Anniversary with its in-house Heuer 2 automatic chronograph movement. In conclusion, the Tag Heuer Carrera 60th Anniversary is a special edition watch that pays homage to the iconic Carrera collection's rich history and racing heritage. The Tissot Sideral S Powermatic 80 is a notable timepiece in Tissot's extensive lineup, known for its combination of modern design, practical features, and Swiss watchmaking heritage. The case of the Tissot Sideral offers a tino-shaped profile. It measures 41 mm in diameter by 14.4 mm thick, which includes the slightly domed sapphire crystal that sticks up above the rim of its bezel. The actual outer diameter of the bezel comes in at 39 mm, and since the lugs are completely integrated into the shape of the case, the total lug-to-lug -lug distance of the Tist sideral measures 46.5 mm. This makes the watch wear slightly smaller than its 41 mm on paper size might otherwise indicate. Surrounding the crystal is a stainless steel bezel with a black PVD finish, and it moves unidirectionally with a 120-click motion. Additionally, since the Tissot Sideral is designed to be a multi-purpose water sports watch, its luminous bezel is finished with both elapsed time markings and a 10-minute countdown scale so that it can be used as either a dive watch or regatta timer. Meanwhile, the display case back and the signed crown at 3 o'clock are both made from stainless steel and screw down to the case in order to help guarantee the watch's 300 meters of water resistance. In conclusion, the Tissot Sideral S Powermatic 80 is a well-rounded timepiece that offers a balance of modern design, reliability, and affordability. The Chupar LUC1860 is a prestigious and exquisite timepiece crafted by Chupar a renowned Swiss watchmaker known for its exceptional craftsmanship and luxury watches. The case on the LUC1860 measures in at a classy 36.5 mm diameter and is crafted from Chupar's proprietary lucent steel. The steel case, though refined and elegant in its own right, provides a visual counterpoint to the dial, which is pure luxury. The dial is crafted from solid gold, but a galvanic treatment gives the dial a salmon hue. The contrasting finishes give the dial a dynamic, three-dimensional appearance. Chupard includes finely gillucked rings to demarcate the minute scale, central zone, and small seconds counter, while using a hand gillucked radiating pattern to surround the Chupar logo on a cartridge at 12 o'clock. The chapter ring receives satin brushing, and the small second counter utilizes snailing. That's an incredible amount of detail and hand finishing. Popping against the salmon backdrop are white gold chevron indices, complemented by a faceted white gold dolphin handset. The LUC1860 is powered by the LUC 96.40L movement that produced the Chupar Manufacture Watchmaking Workshop. The movement is incredibly thin at just 3.3 mm, thanks in large part to the off-center 22 karat gold micro-rotor that winds the twin barrels that provide 65 hours of power reserve. In conclusion, the Chupar LUC1860 is a symbol of timeless elegance and fine watchmaking.